Enforcements are here. Try to stay calm. What? What should we do? Just stay down. Commander, more service troops are heading your way. If you can hold the line there, it'll give us civilians time to escape. You heard him. We hold here. Enforcements are here. Try to stay calm. What? What should we do? Just stay down. Commander, more service troops are heading your way. If you can hold the line there, it'll give the civilians time to escape. You heard him. We hold here.
Good work, everyone. I'll pick you up at the LZ, Commander. Getting reports of continuing strikes against other cities on Benning. Cerberus still denying responsibility? Yes, and for once we're inclined to believe them gunning down innocent humans isn't their usual MO. Either way, the civilians down there have a chance now. We're solidifying a foothold and getting people out, then we'll move to liberating the rest of the planet. I hope we can say the same for Earth. One day, Commander. For now, we've got our work cut out for us. Carry on. Popular for a while. 
They were fighting the Collectors while the Council sat and watched. And now they're killing civilians and attacking our allies. Commander? Signal confirmed. Evasion successful. something. Reapers eluded. Faster than light jump successful. Signal confirmed.
evasion successful. something. Reapers eluded. light jump successful. Transferring your docking clearance to an Alliance official. Figures. Finally back in action, the Alliance already wants us tagged and collared. Just our way of welcoming you back, Flight Lieutenant. Uh, yes ma'am. Requesting docking permission? Docking permission granted. Would you like private transport arranged? I need to get to the embassies. Navigation is becoming increasingly difficult due to the number of refugee ships in the docking area. Thank you. 
Urgently, human, I must speak to you on behalf of my people. What is it? Holding sorrow, Dakuna, my home world, the Reapers have come. Holding sorrow, our warriors are under siege, but your forces can rescue them. Urgently, please, all the other races have turned us aside. How do your people fight? Proudly, with BI-assisted infantry, our soldiers carry heavy weapons into battle mounted on their backs. Mixed pride and shame, our enemies have called us living tanks, as well as names less flattering. I'll take the Normandy as soon as we have time. Relief. Thank you, Commander. Small hope. Perhaps we can evacuate some of our civilians when your forces arrive. Anxiously, I will remain here for news. Please hurry, Takuna Burns. Reaper forces have been sighted in the Planetha system. I want all remaining files secured and marked for Tentron clearance only. Commander Shepard, thank you for coming. Did you find something? The Council has ordered a full review into Donald Udina's activities. We're still piecing together his coup attempt. But that isn't why I asked you here. The situation is growing urgent for my people. We're aware your Crucible is still missing a key component. The Catalyst? Do you know something? Not exactly, but there is a artifact on our homeworld, Thessia, known only to highest levels of my government. What is it? With any luck, it's a means to help you locate the catalyst. The artifact is kept in a temple located at these coordinates. I've ordered a scientific team to meet you there. If this artifact is so important, why keep it hidden? Every species in the Citadel has its secrets, Commander. But this one, in the wrong hands, would upset the balance of galactic power. The Reapers are doing that right now. Which is why I'm bringing this to you. I appreciate the help. It's you who will be helping us. The Matriarchs are growing desperate. For the first time in our history, Thessia is vulnerable. For all our intellect, we're outmatched by Reaper firepower. I'll do what I can. Whether you know it or not, you've become the sole ray of hope in a very dark night. Goddess be with you. Hey, Shepard. I have to admit, the place feels safer with you here. Everyone's walking around in a daze, or in my case, limping. And I wonder if we'll ever be the same. These are dark days for all of us. 
Thought you'd be in the hospital. If I'm breathing, I'm working. Probably the worst I've ever been hurt. Fitting, I guess, given the state of the galaxy. But if Cerberus thinks a few slugs is gonna keep me out of action, they've got another thing coming. Can this station be defended? The internal security breaches have been patched, but we're dangerously low on manpower. We're grilling our own people and trying to figure out if Udina acted alone, but it's time-consuming. All in all, we're still vulnerable, but I think we've taken the right steps. All that time you were working for Adina, did you ever suspect? Always rubbed me a little wrong. Still, that traitorous bastard upped me. Probably made me for an idiot. <laughs> I guess I proved him right. He's dead. And you're still here, Bailey. <laughs> Thanks to you. If you hadn't shown up, Odina and Cerberus would be dancing on my grave. How does the Citadel fit into the war now? Uh, the war finally found us. This is so far beyond our imagination, and we have been trained to expect the unexpected. Since the coup attempt, folks are shutting down and shutting in. I hear a lot of praying. And crying. They're saying this is the war to end all wars. Well, I haven't seen anything to say they aren't right. No time for rest. Good luck, Bailey. Yeah, you too, Shepard. It seems the galaxy can't keep us apart. Since we took back Omega, I've been consolidating my resources for the war. It's a little easier to coordinate from here. So unfortunately, I'll be slumming it on the Citadel for the time being. I hope this isn't a social visit. We still have work to do around here. We'll talk later. I'm sure. It seems the galaxy... I hope this isn't a social visit. We still have work to do around here. Are the blood pack falling in line? With Grill in charge? Where all systems go. It's his voice, but my words. Couldn't have asked for a better puppet. The blood pack have committed 2,000 Vorcha to the cause. They'll make up the bulk of the army. What have we gained by having the Eclipse at our disposal? A ton of mechs and elite troopers for stealth operations. Sane has turned out to be more malleable than Jonas Sedaris ever was. My control of Eclipse runs even deeper than I expected. You surprised me by taking such agency in the matter. How's the rebuilding going on Omega? People understand the first order of business is shoring up defenses. No one wants another invasion. So they're enduring valiantly, not that they have a choice. Once again, I am Omega. We'll talk later. I'm sure.
Go have fun! I'll guard the table. Damn it, morale is pitiful. I'm curious, what material is your face made from? The surface is a flexible biomimetic nanomaterial over a metallic skull. The skin uses sheer thickening technology to help protect the central processing unit in the head. If the skin is struck or shot, it solidifies to absorb the impact. It also is capable of limited self-healing. And what about the hair? It is of similar construction. For defense, I have set it to cohere into a solid piece. However, for infiltration purposes, it can be parted into individual strands. If it has recently been exposed to water, I generally can't do a thing with it. I miss afterlife. at Huerta Memorial Hospital. Welcome to Serta. Thank you for shopping. Knowles, this is Shepard. I found one of the code locations. Okay, I'll shut it down. Just need to authorize your Spectre status. Someone used this to cut off power to a dozen life support machines in the hospital. Okay, that access code is officially disabled. Can you find any more? Just stay calm. Credits went through. Time to die. Ambassador? By the... I don't... You saved my life. I almost died because the Turians thought I was still with Cerberus. Did those mercs hurt you? I'm fine. They wanted me alive until the fees were delivered for my capture. They didn't care about what I had to say. You kept mentioning a colony in your message. 
Information on the Turian planet's defense system. They'll strike soon. But if I tell you which planet they're attacking, Cerberus will know I turned traitor. I saved your life. Tell me which planet you put in danger. I can offer a bargain. The Volus bombing fleet. In tactical terms, it's worth far more than a colony. Or you could give us both. You can warn the Turians there'll be an attack, Commander. That should be general enough to ward off suspicion. You have a deal. Don't even think about backing out on it. Done. You won't regret it. Air support is our greatest strength. I'll speak with Citadel Security about this... incident. You have my thanks. Got your message, Miranda. Is this about your sister? Shepard, I need access to Alliance resources. I can't say any more. You'll just have to trust me. I don't like secrets, Miranda. Just tell me what's going on. I can't, Shepard. If that's a problem, I'll go. Don't. Trust is a little hard to come by right now. Of course. If you can't tell me anything, I'm not taking resources away from the fight. Fair enough. I was wrong to ask for help. Not wrong, but I can't do it. Is there anything else? Yes. I need to tell you something. Confess, really. It's been eating away at me. Confess? <sighs> when I headed the Lazarus Project to rebuild you, I wanted to implant a control chip in you as a safeguard. But the elusive man stopped me. Sounds like it would have saved him a lot of trouble. Maybe. He didn't want to interfere with who you truly were. Something that just obeyed orders. He wanted Commander Shepard. Installing the chip might have ruined you. I'm glad you didn't. Better to stay dead than be someone's plaything. Exactly. Why bring that up now? I fought against my father and his need to run every aspect of my life. He wanted total control over me, right down to my bloody DNA. After I got out of there, I couldn't stand by and let it happen to my sister. I risked my life to get her away from all that. Yet I didn't give a second thought to destroying your free will when I had the power. This is what's been bothering you? Yes. Miranda, I lost two years of my life. You gave me back the rest of it. You could have taken everything from me, made me a prisoner. But you didn't. I don't know how. But you brought me back. Thanks. But with so much being uncertain, I just wanted you to know I always regretted wanting that chip. You can't keep beating yourself up over the past. I usually don't. But this was important. Some things you just don't have control over. Guess my fancy genetics can't help me there. No. They can't. Okay. I hate to say it, but I should get moving. Thanks for understanding, Shepard. Of course. And Miranda. This thing you have to do. Good luck. Don't worry, Shepard. I always have a plan.
Commander, unless you can find a new source of weapons for CSEC, I'm putting together a task force to stop the Blue Suns myself. I'll get you your weapons, General. I appreciate the effort, but I've... Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. All Welcome to Casa Fabrication Weaponry. All goods have been marked down with our special wartime discount. Casa Fabrication Weaponry hasn't forgotten Earth. Neither should you. Welcome to Nosastra Sporting Goods. Good hunting. You're back, huh? Here. I've got some pieces for you. Done deal, Commander. Check in with General Oraka. You'll see I'm making CSEC very happy. Welcome to Cipertine Armory. Thank you for shopping at Cipertine Armory. Welcome to Agor Munitions. Thank you for shopping at Agor Munitions. Hello, Shepard. Another one. Yeah, the guys in Sakara did too. Disarmed their safe prisoners. Yeah, he's in his attempt. It's a survivor's. I just don't understand why you're suddenly so conflicted. Look, we asked you to kill him over. Of course. We can have ships at the colony in 36 hours. Do you need medical support? No, evacuating the colony is more than enough. Thank you, Ambassador. Ambassador? I'm coordinating actions for the fleet while we're here. Evacuating colonies, bolstering Turian defense lines. Huh. I think it was right here. Three years ago to the day. What? This was where Seren's assassins fired at me. I'd just gotten to the Citadel. I didn't think I needed my barriers up. My mistake. Saren had assassins after you? Right. I disabled the Geth and found that recording that proved he was working with the Reapers. I went to Ilium and tried to inform the authorities, but Saren's mercenaries attacked me. I barely escaped. I stowed away on a Turian freighter and came out here. I thought I was safe. You never told me about this. How bad was it? Got me in the arm. I used polonium rounds. I was running a fever in minutes. It was the first time I'd been really hurt on my pilgrimage. I ran to the Council Embassy, asked for protection, offered the data on Seren. The Turian clerk called me Soot Rat. He threatened to have me tossed off the station if I didn't leave. I wish that clerk could see you now. He just did. That was him back there. I don't think he remembers me. Maybe we should go have a little talk with that clerk. <laughs> I spent three years waiting to come back and make his life hell. But when I finally saw him, he was just a clerk whose people desperately need help. Which they'll get, thanks to you. Nice work, Ambassador. This war is more important than grudges and prejudice. 
Maybe he and I both needed to grow up a little. The difference is that you helped when it counted. Thanks, Shepard. So did you. I just don't understand why you're suddenly so conflicted. Look, the ass was cut. Commander Shepard, I was just contacted by a black market dealer who's donating high-end weapons to CSEC. He wanted you to know. Sounds like you came through. And the Blue Suns can go about their business. Now we'll be focusing on Citadel defense. It won't bring Palavan back, but it's something. Thank you, Commander. More trouble in the Perseus arm as Reaper forces now control the Hades Nexus and Sentry Omega Cluster. Combine Arsenal Supplies. Elkos Combine. If it exists, we carry it. Thank you. Come again. Welcome to Kanala Exports. We appreciate your visit. Status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Docking Bay E-24, Emergency Civilian Housing. Are you okay? I've just been standing here, holding this for, I don't know, it'll always be a part of me. Your past is yours. I recovered your pillars of strength from the kite's nest. They're yours, waiting in bay D-24. Thank you. Right now, my alien needs any reminder of the faith they can get. Welcome to Batarian State Arms. Please observe all cast restrictions when making a purchase. Stand strong for your people with Batarian State Arms. Thank you for your patronage. James? Commander, what brings you down here? I was about to ask you that. Well, after our little chat, ow, I made up my mind. I'm gonna join the N7 program. And you're celebrating by getting a tattoo? <laughs> sort of. See, there's no official channels to go through right now. So, I guess this is my way of making it official. Technically, I'm just an N7 recruit, but, you know, I figure with you as my training officer, how could I fail, right? I'm flattered, but I wouldn't exactly say I'm training you. Not officially, but what the hell is in this goddamn war? 
I'm just saying, whether you like it or not, you're my direct superior and you're N7. So I take my lead from you. And you know, I'll take whatever advice you got. Really? Sure. The good advice. Well, they wouldn't ask you if they didn't think you could handle it. Here's hoping. But the real work starts now. Uh-huh. I know it seems like I don't take things seriously, but when I commit to something, I fully commit. Clearly. Hey, I won't let you down. The only person you need to prove yourself to is the one standing in the mirror every morning. Good point. You know, that's gonna sting for a few days. You gonna be ready for duty? Well, I'm not looking forward to slapping my armor back on, but I'm always ready. Glad to hear it. Ah! Careful! I'd like to request a transfer to a zone with Reaper Sergeant. And may I ask why you think your deployment is... Knowles, I found another spot where the Batarian codes were used. Holy crap. These are the remote navigation codes. Last week's crash at the docks, we thought it was an accident. Shepard, there were 117 Alliance soldiers on that ship. All human. Just like the patients at the hospital. So we've got Batarian code. Looks like... okay. This code's offline now as well. Should just be one left, Commander. More trouble in the Perseus arm as Reaper forces now control the Hades Nexus and Sentry Omega Hello? Anne? Are you here? Anne? Oh, Commander. Yes, I'm sorry. Just... This is hard. Of course. Are you all right? Yes. No. I don't know. <clears throat> My father and I didn't leave things in a great state. An argument? Yes. It was trivial. A disagreement on how to file some of the specimens. I was mad about something else. I don't remember what. And I took it out on him. S so stupid. It's all right. I can come back. No, please. I'm okay. Seeing all this again? He was so obsessed. Crazy sometimes. I didn't get a chance to know him. 
Oh, sometimes I felt the same way. He was a great man, a pioneer. But he could be distant. I felt like an inconvenience growing up. You sound angry. I was angry. Still am, I guess. But sometimes, he was so full of stories, he nearly burst. I love that about him. It's why I signed up for this work. <laughs> I can't believe he's gone. We'll figure this out. We have to. I need to know what's on the other end of that artifact. What he died for. We need your help. You're our last chance. You're right. Let me dig into my father's work to see what I can find. Anne, you sure you're up for this? Yes. When Leviathan took control of me, I remember being somewhere cold and dark. But my father taught me to never be afraid of the dark. I'm still amazed your father got his hands on a piece of a Reaper. He was so excited. Your claims validated years of work. Did you take appropriate steps to prevent indoctrination? Of course.